ang Maynila and the rest of the greater Manila area. Uh, medyo, there was a substantial compliance. I would not say that there was no violation. There were violations, but uh, not in a scale I saw in other places. Na kamong mga Cebuano, masuko mo ingon ko gahi mo ulo. Actually, ayaw mo kainsulto kay Cebuano ko. I am a Cebuano. I come from the now Cebu. Ka mga Bisaya talaga, baski sa Dabao, yung mga Bisaya doon, ang titigas talaga ng ulo, hindi mo pasunod. Yan ang totoo. Yan talaga, prangkahan ko kayo, magalit kayo, masuko mo na ako, hindi masuko, pagkunin nyo. Eh, sinabi na eh, and I could, do not, no, 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 do not. F with me. Because nanonood ako ng government stations. Kinukuha lahat yung anong, ng talisay. Talisay was like a marketplace every day. Nagiinuman ka dyan, nagsusugal. Uh, almost nonchalant of the, the, the dangers uh, that were rolling around. So, ayaw rin yung maniwala. Ngayon kito, bakit marami? Well, the, the, one of the reasons really, I would say, even without consulting the, the body, uh, because you did not follow rules. Hindi ganun karami yan. You have the highest. Cebu is now the hotspot for uh, COVID. Bakit? Eh, wala mong sunod eh. Marami sa inyo hindi sumunod. Kaya yeah, huwag ninyo akong mag magalit-galit kayo sa akin. Uh -huh. Look, I am here to run government. I'm, I'm not here to stay forever. As a matter of fact, uh, I am on my last two years. God, you, you better shape up. I, I will not... Diyak mo naman ko kasi bisaya tayo that you'll have a special place in this. Di na mo nangyari ng 